Welcome back to Make Way for Cat. So now that we have quelled Lilligant, we are going to be talking to the commander again. Hmm, I stumbled on a quest to... Here we go, this one. You after medicine that can cure Sidex headaches? Well, you came to the right person. Take this. It's a secret medicine that only those from my hometown know how to make. An astonishing medicine that can instantly restore health to any Pokemon. It is produced by an apothecary in Cyanwood City. Even a Sidex headache will clear it up. Aww. Commend you on your successful research of the Pokemon living in the Crimson Mirelands. Your next orders are to begin the survey of the Cobalt Coastlands. I'm seeing a, a pattern here. Obsidian, Crimson, Cobalt. I will let you know in advance. There are no Pokemon nobles in the Cobalt Coastlands. Allow me to explain. We did have a lord in the coastlands until a few years ago. A tragedy took him from us. Oh. Now we've had reports of people seeing strange shadowy figures on the island the lord used to call his home. We've also received word from both the security corps and the supply corps. It seems some of their members were attacked by a ghost while out gathering materials around Fire Pit... Fire Spit Island. These are serious concerns, and moreover, my clan just can't tolerate this desecration of our late lord's seat. Normally, I'd entrust this to our warden in the coastlands, but her situation is complicated. I trust my intentions are clear by now. I hereby order you to investigate these reports. The Lordless Island. Oh, and... I know this must be a bewildering situation to be dropped into. I'm sorry, Cat. Think nothing of it. Cat is a talented and hardworking member of the Galaxy team. I'm sure she will sort things out. Indeed, Cat quelled the Lord of the Woods. I've seen both her strength and her kindness firsthand. The next area for you to investigate will be the Cobalt Coastlands. It is farther afield than the Crimson Mirelands, much further, and the path is long and trying. With your current rank, you should be capable of braving the Cobalt Coastlands. You know your mission. Investigate Fire Spit Island. Alright. If it isn't Cat, what's Leon doing here? Though I suppose it's to be expected that I'd run into you in the village. Where are you going? Where are you going to study Pokemon next? Ah, uh, the Cobalt Coastlands. Oh, the Cobalt Coastlands. Lena's certainly in a bit of a situation over there. She's a warden, and yet she has no noble to see to. There are even some people in the Pearl Clan that speak ill of her, though not to her face. Oh, but do forgive me. Perhaps I shouldn't be airing dirty laundry. A piece of advice, then, as an apology for wasting your time. Some Pokemon are strongly affected by certain stones, which hold mysterious power. With the right stone, you can evolve some Pokemon. You need look no further than Cleaver for proof of that. What I'm trying to say is basically this. If you and the Survey Corps want to learn all there is to know about the Pokemon of this region, then the stones you find throughout Hisui will be very important. There's even a tale of a stone that contains the power of creation, the very same power Almighty Sinnoh used to create the universe. I trust you'll take my advice to heart and not underestimate how important stones can be. To help grind this fact into you here, I'll give you some rather handy stones and things I found. 
Grip pebbles. Oh, yeah. And should you want some stones that can help evolve, I believe the Ginkgo Guild has them from time to time. Alright. I have no, no desire to do Crimson Mirelands anymore. I might do it off for off screen. Complete some research, but uh, I don't love it there. Not my favorite place to be. It's pretty. Ah, uh, the Cobalt Coastlands, a simply lovely corner of Hisui. Sea and sky as far as the eye can see. What kinds of Pokemon await us here, I wonder? Water types? Or flying types, perhaps? Oh, I simply can't wait to study them all. <laughs> he takes out his camera. That's a cool looking camera. Now I'm sure you're just as excited as I am to research this area's Pokemon, but let's not forget that you have a mission to accomplish. Any questions before you get started? About that warden. Wardens, in fact. Here in the Cobalt Coastlands, you'll find Paulina of the Pearl Clan and Iskan of the Diamond Clan. Perhaps they'll be of some help to you as you dig into those curious occurrences. Okay. Oh, this gives me major, uh, Ashara World of Warcraft vibes. Exactly how the zone is laid out. Okay. Speak to Irida there. Uh, she is actually right in front of us. New request? A couple lost satchels. Quite a few, actually. Fire Spit Islands all the way over here. Lava Dome Sanctum. Seaside Hollow. Turn Back Cave. Another request. Okay. Oh yeah, there's the, uh... It looks like pincer coming out of the ground, or out of the water. I imagine we'll get Basque Legion, right? Oh, her shoes look like Pokeballs. Oh, that's so cool. I do love the flute. It feels as if its tones carry to the very ends of space. But I am here, and so are you. So now I'm going to focus everything I have on battling you. Uh, why? I mean, I would ask that too. Very good. You who have seen the vast space beyond the rift, here I come. Uh, Oglacian, that's right. Oh good, I put lava up first. And a- what? Why is there an Eevee here? 30. You're done for. Oh, she has an Eevee, too. A level 15 Eevee. Oh, how cute. Sorry. I didn't do much. Oh. Yeah, you are fast. Oh, that's right. I did use strong style, though, on the first one. Close.
Ah, now I feel better. World is vast, and I am small within it. Thank you. Allow me to heal your Pokemon. Alright, with you, I think with you I can be frank. I can't afford to look weak in front of the Diamond Clan's leader or your commander, but in truth... I sometimes wonder how I've ended up with the burdens I bear. You see, we have a warden in the coastlands, a lovely woman named Polina. But she tends no lord or lady, and she will not raise a successor to fill the late lord's empty seat either. Some people have started to question her worthiness to be a warden at all. But Lena, that is to say, Polina, she's very dear to me, no matter what anyone might say. We were both in the running to become leader of the Pearl Clan. We strove to surpass one another, but she taught me a great deal, too. Having said all this, I have a favor to ask of you. Please help her raise the Pokemon she looks after into a true heir to his father, the late Lord. With the help of your strength, I think our late Lord's heir would grow into a worthy successor. And if he succeeds, it should silence Lena's naysayers. I don't know if anyone I'd trust more to help with this than the person who helped the Pearl Clan by quelling Cleaver's frenzy. You'll be able to find Lena up on the headland. Head down this hill and turn left. You should find a slope leading up to the ridge. Alright, so we have a base camp here. Oh, there's a satchel over here somewhere. This satchel thing is cute, but no one's picked up mine yet, and I lost that one. Like two days ago? Oh, right in front of me. Oh, I didn't even realize that was a Pokemon. Purloin? I, I can't remember. I think either it's Purloin or it evolves into a Purloin. Oh, wrong button. Blammeow, okay. It's like one of the few Pokemon cats that I, I don't really care for. I am going to catch it eventually. Just want to explore a bit. So we do need to go to the north, which means I'm going to go to the south. Because that's how it works. <gasps> Wal oh, an alpha wall wall rain? Tangle is here too. Napalm? It is napalm. Okay, they aren't aggressive either. Oh, what's this? Diamond Clan tent? Oh, that's right, there was another person here. Nobody's home. Diamond Clan warden. Another apalm. I actually don't know what the evolved form of a palm is called. Uh, come here. I have to get off this. I'm in trouble. Ambi palm. Oh, not not toward him. We. I'll catch you eventually. Oh, this is. Actually, I don't recognize this one. It was like three generations of Pokemon that I did not mop them. Oh, oh. Hi. We gonna play? You're cute, though. What are you, 30? Add super effective. That's... Yep. I that could be a bad idea. Okay, we'll catch you eventually.
Yeah, right into the grass. Where are you going? Home bees are back out here too. Gonna run from me. Oh, oh. Motham, are you sleeping? <gasps> Please. Oh, you know what? Bam. Please work. Yeah. Super cute. Aw, oh, man. Heavy balls. <sighs> they work well sometimes. Oh, we're also looking for like a... A three-foot weasel as well. What's this? Pop pod. Okay. Okay. Go in the opposite direction that I want to go. No thanks. No thanks. No thanks. Sorry, didn't know you were napping there. Weasels are aggressive. Oh, an alpha ambipom. Yeah, literally walked right in front of it. That was dumb. No, is that a sphere? Uh, yes, please, on the sphere. Oh my gosh. Oh, sphere, you're so cute. Why are you rolling at me? Turn around. You're so cute. Oh, turn around, please. Turn around so I can throw this ball at you. Can I just throw this ball at you anyway? Yes. Oh, feel. And then we got a big old Chansey here. Oh man, heavy balls. Get it. Right in the back. Please work. Nice. Level 41? That's pretty good. I want another one. Just for reasons. Right in the back. Oh, that's so great. Aleppo berries. Okay, it was worth coming to this side of the coast. Wow, we're only here? I thought we had gotten down here. This looks like a hand. That's super creepy. Can we get up there? Uh, not this way. What if we go straight this way? Hide away. Excuse me. I think those alpha Pokemon are, are supposed to be some kind of deterrent. Like, you see it and you're like, oh no, run! Just run right by them. Oh, you're looking for something. Excuse me. Have you seen a fellow from the construction corps named Yorick? No, I haven't. Ah, oh, this is hopeless. Where could he have gone? Would you mind helping me track him down? I'll be waiting a little further ahead. Please come see me when you have a moment. 
awesome, the Coastlands camp. Here we go. What do we have here? Starly's evolution. Oh. No thanks. Oh, another Psyduck. Hi. What are you? Is that a Togepi? can't tell if it's facing forward. Oh, there it is. Oh, oh, oh no, oh no. He ran away. Okay. Ooh, Golduck. Uh, not that I really care much about a Golduck. I actually don't even want to evolve my Psyduck. I want him to stay my little blue Psyduck forever. Flies are back here too. Curious what rock Pokemon is in that, but I just want to explore this more still. Ooh, is firing at me. Probably Beautifly. <gasps> is that Chatot? I used Chatot so much in X and Y. I believe it's X and Y. X and Y was the Pokemon series I that. I got back into Pokemon with. Uh, we want lightning. For birds. Actually, we might be able to catch this. Come on, Chatot. Oh, right in the butt. Oh, you left. I'm gonna have to make some more of those. That's gonna run away. Ah, shipwreck. Cool. You don't see me. You don't see me. I'm not doing anything. You're way out of the way. Maybe this one up here will be closer. have one of these left. Right in the face. Please work. I really want you. Aww. Alright then. It's gonna run away. Yep. No thanks. Are these just for look? There's not really anything. I'm gonna go under here. Take that. I'm in trouble. Someone's firing something at me. The treasure chest? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Is it still- ch something's still chasing? Oh, it's still chasing me. Okay, not anymore. Oh uh, yeah, there's those pincer tower things. And we're in like the hand. What? What is this? Oh, is this where this person is- Oh, you're here. I've been waiting. Like I said, I need your help finding York from the construction core. He and I came out here to set up base camp, but then he went off on his own to get the lay of the land and hasn't come back. York ought to still be near somebody, somewhere nearby. If you find him, please tell him to come back here already. Okay. I want to go over there. Ah, Drifflim. And Drifflim. This is really creepy. And a wisp over there. There's gotta be some significance with this. It's terrifying though. Super ominous. Oh, Pokemon in the water! 
Who we got? Fish? Oh, okay. Angry fish. Alright, let's get that. Oh, someone's satchel. Let's get the wisp. Oh, that's where they are right there. The little pincers. And we spent already like 20 minutes just in this south side. I think that's another wisp over there. A talking poke. Oh, are you? Oh, that's the guy, isn't it? Can I have it? Yorick, stay away! Away, stay! Wow, why is this Pokemon talking? Because it's a parrot. You alright? Help me. Uh, I want it. Can I please have it? Can I just catch you? Oh, I do have Luxray out, which is probably a bad idea. I could probably one-shot this guy. Oh my gosh, he's tiny! Oh... Okay. We're gonna... Although, my Luxray is huge. Huge. Item. Ugh, I'm out of my flying balls. I'm gonna use a heavy ball. You such a cute little chat talk, please. Yes. The one that was harassing York, too. It's great. I don't know how, how I'd survive without you. No one told me there'd be Pokemon that talk like people out here. What a fright. It's just mimicking you. Back where I grew up, folks often said that if you heard hear someone talk when nobody's around, it's not a ghost playing tr tricks, it's just a chat hot. Anyway, thank you kindly for finding Yorick. I'll have him set up camp now. And we got a chat hot. It's not one of my favorite Pokemon because it's a, it's like one of my favorite, po it's, it's just a very nostalgic Pokemon. Like when you have the villagers in um, Animal Crossing that you've just had since way back in the day. What a splendidly scenic base camp. This ought to be quite convenient for surveying Pokemon that live on the waterfront. Okay. Oh, it's called Sans Reach, but it's like a hand reaching. S still super creepy. Um, but I like creepy, so. Okay, I want to get this. Was oh, it an island? I don't think I'm going to be able to get to that. Why to jump? <gasps> what? I didn't know he could jump. Alpha Chansey. Nope. No thank you. Nothing to see here. Oh, that must be the, uh, the Fire Island. Fire Spit Island. Alright, um, I think this is time. When we come back, we'll take on the top part of this island. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.